Watching sunrise meets my skin. You with my eyes. Hey everyone, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you're all feeling really well. Welcome to my first video of 2022. It's been a while. I'm happy to be back. I'm happy to be back with one of my favorite kind of videos. My house right now, at the start of 2022, is in disarray it's just a disaster and i need to get it up to a more livable standard and i just want to organize like every section of my house to a t so it's just going to run more smoothly as we go on throughout the year so i thought i'd start a little series on my channel and hopefully you can follow along with me let's get our houses sorted let's clean sort out our lives for 2022 and then hopefully if we stay on top of it it should make for a more smoother running household. I really want 2022 to be the year of growth and development. And I feel like my house is a great place to start because I feel like without a home that runs well, a home that's in order, a home where you can find things, a home where anyone in your family can find things, then it can affect your mental health and just how your days run really. It is a mess, I mean. I'm living in chaos right now. And then I also have a big cherries order, which I'm gonna share with you in a minute. I'm sorry if you can hear rustling because Amora is eating some raisins in the background. You okay? Yeah. So I'll show you that cherries order because that has got lots of cleaning products and things I'm going to be using in my house within this series. And I'm just gonna get straight into this video. So here is going to be my starting point of the day. And actually it's not even my starting point because I have put some pots and pans and plates into the dishwasher. You may have noticed a pan behind me when I, was, when I was doing my intro. So I have just put the dishwasher on and now I am going to start clearing this kitchen. There's bits on the side, there's stuff everywhere. Everything needs a wipe down. And then I also have some food shopping on the floor, which I need to put away. So to put this food away, I decided the best place to start in this kitchen will be the pantry cupboard, which is where most of this food lives. So here it is here. I mean, it's not too bad, but things need filling up. As you can see, we were empty on a few items there, hence the food shop, and it just needs a general tidy. Things have just got a little bit out of place, basically, and I just want to take everything out, wipe it all down, disinfect it, and just make sure there's no loose crumbs in the cupboard anymore, and it's all clean and fresh. <laughs> Appalachian sunrise meets my skin Even with my eyes still closed, I can feel it coming in Golden, golden. I'll follow only golden Golden, golden, golden things In spring, rainbow trout and hummingbird wing. Golden, I'll follow the golden, golden, golden things. Gold hair, gold ring. cupboards, emptying them, giving them a wipe down, putting the new food into jars and containers before they go back into the cupboard. And then I'm also going through my back stock of food, checking these cans, making sure that they are all still in date and getting rid of anything that may be out of date. Golden, 
okay so the pantry cupboard is completed I'm really pleased with it it looks a lot neater tidier I can see everything everything has its own place which is exactly what I wanted and if I ever run low on stock I can also see that as well so I'm really pleased with it and then if you'd like to know where the labels are from I got them from an Instagram shop called the Greeners Collective they are also on Etsy and I will leave them linked down below so Ed is actually back for his lunch and he's watching the little ones downstairs so I am able to come up here and share with you my cherries order. So I'm really excited to get stuck into this box. If you've not heard of cherries then it is an app that you can get on your phone or you can shop it online and the best way to describe it is like having a home bargains and B&M on your phone. I love just flicking through the app seeing what new things they have on there. So cherries really kindly gifted me this order and I decided to go with cleaning products. As I've mentioned I need to get my house up together and I also wanted products that is going to motivate me in this new year just to get started and stay on track with my home. The range of things that they have on the app go from food, toys, to some clothing, to homeware bits. It is really worth having a little look on the app because you can get some amazing things for some amazing prices and we all love a bargain don't we? Shop from the comfort of your home and get all of those cheap products that you would if you went out to Home Bargains and B&M. As this haul is in collaboration with Cherries they have given me a discount code for you to use off your first orders from Cherries cherries and that's Gillian 20 for 20% 20 off so it's just the perfect time to pick up things that you may need in your kitchen cupboard cleaning products and bits you may need at home they have beauty products so you can get money off your everyday favorites which are already great affordable prices and it's a win-win really so yeah let's get into what I have picked for myself of cherries like I said there's so many things that you can go on there and look at wow <laughs> I've got a lot of stuff in this box so first of all really random actually this isn't cleaning so I just thought I'd run through this quick this is some tracing paper which I have bought for the kids they had loads of arty crafty bits on there so I just got them some tracing paper because you don't actually have any tracing paper at home and I thought they'd find that really fun a home favorite Lenore scent boosters so I've got the gold orchid you're gonna have to ignore my nails in this video because they are honestly horrific but I'm gonna get them done this week I got this barkeeper's friend now I can't remember how much this is I don't think this is a very affordable brand I think it's a little bit more pricier than other standard cleaning products I may be wrong there so it might be worth checking and maybe I'll try and see if I can find the price of it somewhere online but this is barkeeper's friend all-purpose power clean I've just heard really 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 good things about barkeeper's friend so I thought it'd be a really handy product to have inside my cupboards I had a cleaner not long ago and she used this and it was just amazing so I thought I would try it for myself I also picked up some fabric conditioner so this is just Lenore again and it is the divine range in scent ruby jasmine I think I just picked up some washing bits because I got a hell of a lot of washing to get through and I need some really gorgeous scents to inspire me to want to do some washing. So this is a super random object but can you find these really super random things that you didn't even know you needed but when you see them on the app you think actually I could really do with that so this is a pizza tray when I mean, it's just what it says on the tin and I just thought that'd be really really handy I've got these Sif outdoor furniture wipes I mean we're not really going outdoor at the moment because it's cold but I thought that these will start coming really in handy as we move on to spring and into summer we have toys out in our garden and things that have been left out there throughout winter so they will need a good wipe and scrub down before the kids can start playing with them in the spring marigolds i needed some new marigolds another really random buy but i thought i'm gonna give this a go and try it is this grout pen i've never ever used a grout pen before this is from a brand called block it just refreshes discolored grout instantly but yeah i can't wait to give that a go and give my bathrooms a freshen up I I picked up a super soft drying mat this is going to go in our utility room because that's where I do a lot of the hand wash items we have a dishwasher which we mainly use but I will do hand washing for our baby bottles bottles and sippy cups that the girls use for school got a little drying rack in our utility room and I normally put a tea towel underneath but I just thought that this would be really good to put underneath that rack glass and window surface wipes just to quickly wipe down glass and mirrors I have five young children living in this house and there are fingerprints all over the class nothing stays fingerprintless in this house for long fridge refreshers so that's actually quite handy because I'm going to be cleaning out our fridge today and reorganizing it this lasts up to six months eliminates odors and unpleasant smells never used one of these in my fridge before so we're going to give it a go and I'll let you know what I think got the Dr Beckman glow white for our whitewashes just to make them nice and bright 
And along the same lines, I bought the Vanish Oxy Action Crystal White. I also got some Dove baby wipes. They also have a lot of baby products on the Cherries app. White vinegar spray, always really handy to have this in the kitchen. I bought a Finish Deep Washer, Deep Cleaner for the dishwasher, just to give it a nice clean. Along the same lines as the grout pen, I bought a Tile and Grout Super Scrubber. I'm not sure what makes this sponge a super scrubber compared to other sponges that you can use in your bathroom, but we will give it a go. It says it makes tiles and grout look like new, so we're gonna see if it works. I bought all purpose descaler tablets for the kettle. So I picked up some Sephora in Hello Spring. You know, we're moving past winter and we're moving on to the fresh spring scents now. I also got some Fabulosa in the scent Wild Rhubarb. Love that scent. Right, this is super random. Another one of those things on the app which you don't know you need, but actually think, oh wow, I'll give it a go. I bought a sink snake. Let me know if you've ever used one of these before. I mean, it looks very long and windy. I really need to give all of my plugs a good scrub. So I thought I'd pick up this to try. It says ideal for sinks, showers and bath. I'm actually scared to see what's hiding in our plug holes. Elbow grease washing up liquid. Eraser sponges. I don't always use eraser sponges. I have like once or twice before in the past, but I hear such amazing things about them. So I've got a few more to try. Toilet bowl, fizz and fresh in the pink peony fresh, a pink scrub mummy. These are just amazing. I love a scrub mummies, scrub daddies. Other things that are always really handy to have in the cleaning cupboard are some drain and blockers. So I got this elbow grease drain and blocker. And then I also have this does it drain away drain and blocker. And sometimes on the app, you can get a bundle where they bundle a few products together and you can get it for a set price. And that's what I did with this minky set. If I do still have this bundle on there, I'll put it on the screen right now. But it was just a set price for all these minky bits. So I got a minky high tech duster in this pink color. I do like my cleaning products in pink. I got the grill and pan minky heavy duty sponges. Then we have a general purpose microfiber cloth. We have the original minky. And then I also have these extra large soft and absorbent cleaning cloths. And then we are on to some food bits last. Really random, only picked up a few food bits. We still have lots of Christmas snacks left over from Christmas. And I am trying to be good seeing it's the new year, but I did pick up a couple of bits. So we have the iced coffee, first of all. So this is in flavor caramel. The girls love these cheese savories. These just make a really easy snack, easy to put in lunch boxes, easy to take on days out in little snack pots and they really enjoy them. So it's just a crowd pleaser all round. Pringles in the Texas barbecue sauce flavor needs no explanation burger sauce we really love condiments in this house and burger sauce is one of our favorites if we're especially having burgers of course so got another one for the stockpile and last but not least biscoff biscuits in biscoff cream i mean I think you're either a lover or a hater of Biscoff, and I am definitely a lover. That actually brings me to the end of everything that I got from my Cherries order. Please use my discount if you're going to log on and make an order, because you can save 20% if it is your first order, and who doesn't love a saving? Now let's get back in to the cleaning. Next up, I am going to clean around our dining area. So I've just wiped down the unit and gave it a little dust. I'm going to remove clutter from the table. I'm going to wipe it all down and then I will hoover underneath. You will notice in a minute that I'm doing this around the snack time. Amora and Bodhi will be joining me in their high chairs. And then later on in the day, I managed to clean around their high chairs and hoover under them once they weren't in them anymore. So as a mum, sometimes you just got to do bits here and there where you can. And that is what I've had to do. When I return from the afterglow, will you carry me like I am whole again? Wait, hold on, put me together, take me back where I belong. I want it all. I had a feeling, but the feeling is all gone. Wait, hold on. So now the babies are not in their high chairs, I am going to remove them. I'm going to hoover underneath them because there's always bits of food that they've dropped on the floor there. And then I'm going to give the high chairs a good wipe down. They needed them. I've also used cleaning wipes for this just because they really needed a good scrub down. And I sometimes find that cleaning wipes are really good with those stubborn marks or like hard dried food like wheat bix So that is the high chairs done. 
moving on to more food cupboards now, just giving them a wipe down, a wipe inside, and just rearranging and tidying them up. Show you what I wish I knew. My will is strong with a place to lean. In the moment I hung desperately, the other ring of my wrist is gold. Pairing with the light it holds. When I return from my spinning ball. So this cupboard here is a well used cupboard and it has just got a little bit messy as you can see, a little bit I'd say a lot actually but anyway, it's got messy and it's quite a well used cupboard so in here we keep baby formula, we keep baby food, our toaster, the slow cooker, just lots of things that we use quite a lot hence why it's got really messy and not you can even see what we use in there really because everything is everywhere but it needed a good tidy so here we go. It is also a cupboard that can get full of crumbs because we, as I mentioned, do keep the toaster in there. So after I have gone through everything in the cupboard, I'm going to rearrange them into the correct containers and pop everything all back in. I have this first container here with all of my health bits so it needs a new label actually I'll be getting on ordering that then we have the baby food container and then the baby formula and baby bottles containers so everything is grouped and in its own special category and then down below we have our appliances I've just given them a tidy and then we are on to this cupboard here Again, it's not the worst, but it definitely just needs a tidy up and items have come out of their containers and just been put anywhere. So again, I'm going to get everything out of the cupboard, give it a wipe down as always, and then I'm going to sort through everything, check all of the sell-by dates, make sure everything's in the right container, and then pop it all back away. Just to give you a little overview of what was inside the containers, here it all is. So this is what I'm going to go through and tidy up. I did actually find this creamy pepper sauce which went out of date in 2020 and I thought I was good at keeping on top of my sell by dates. I thought I went through things quite regularly but obviously things slip the net so yeah it's definitely worth checking your sell by dates and making sure there's nothing in there that has long gone out of date. And then this is this cupboard finished. I'm really pleased with it. The only thing I do want to change is I'm going to be changing up the spice jars. I'm just looking for something a little bit different, but everything is organized and has its own place. So I am going to now start sorting out our cutlery drawer. It has gone wild and then nothing is in the right place. It was overflowing. Sometimes we can't even open the drawer because it was so full. So yeah, it just needed a good sort out. So again, just following the same process, taking everything out, giving the drawer a good wipe down. Cutlery drawers can gather a lot of crumbs. So yeah, needed a good clean down. And then I put all of the cutlery into categories and then decided what I needed to keep, what I didn't need to keep. And I also bought some new cutlery just because we were running low on a few 
forks and we never seem to have any but we seem to have like tons of everything else so I just bought a new set so that everything could match and then we had enough of certain items. We are moving on to the fridge which wow as you can see was a mess everything was everywhere I mean look at that pepper how sad was that pepper I don't know what it was still doing in the fridge leftover broken Christmas chocolate I mean what's going on here it is not good so it really needed a good after Christmas clean so I ended up taking everything out of it you know the drill by now I took out the shelves and the drawers and gave them a wash because they needed a proper clean down. And yeah, I didn't end up actually filming too much of the fridge clean, which I'm a bit annoyed about, but I was trying to film a TikTok at the same time. So I'm trying to get into TikTok. So I filmed a clean my fridge with me and that actually took so much time on top of already cleaning the fridge, which was taking a lot of time and my camera ran out of battery and I just couldn't do everything at once. But I will leave my TikTok link down below. I'm really not a TikToker. I'm just trying to do a few videos here and there, just videos of things that I like. So I did our fridge clean. As you can see there, I've got my phone out, that was where I was filming my TikTok, but essentially I took out the drawers, gave them a wash, I had all these new containers here which are from Amazon and from Home Bargains and B&M, and then I ended up washing our fruit and veg, popping the kitchen towel into these containers and then popping them into the fridge and putting labels on them, so I was really pleased with the end result which I am going to show you here. Everything is categorised and grouped together and everything has its own place, own home. The kids can see what's in the fridge, I can see what's in the fridge and we know what we have left before a food shop. So I'm just really happy with how everything turned out once again. Then it was on to dealing with this pile of random stuff that I had leaning against this wall in the kitchen. I mean, we just accumulate clutter in all sorts of areas and this was just that big pile of clutter which needed sorting but I hadn't ever got around to. So this is just the old carry cots for the prams that need putting away for storage now because they're now sitting in their seats, the babies. And then also the newborn part of the high chairs. We changed them over for the normal seats and high chairs because they are starting to wean and eat now. So all the covers needed taken off and all the straps just so I can chuck them in the washing machine and give the newborn seats a good clean down and then the prams need to go into storage. Somewhere in the great unknown when I return from the afterglow Will you carry me like I am whole again? Wait, hold on Put me together, take me back where I belong I want it all I had a feeling but the feeling is all gone Wait, hold on Put me together Take me back where I belong I want it all I had a feeling but the feeling is 
is all gone. So lastly, to finish my kitchen clean, I am going to wipe down the sides, wipe down the sink, wipe down the cupboards, give the room a hoover and a mop, and then that will be the kitchen finished for the day. If I could take you back to my youth And show you what I wish I knew My will is strong with a place to lean In the moment I hung desperately The other ring on my wrist is gold Pairing with the light it holds when I return from my skin and bone, I'm remembering the words you told me. Wait, hold on. Put me together, take me back where I belong. I want it all. I had a feeling, but the feeling is all gone. Wait, hold on. Put me together. Take me back where I belong I want it all I had a feeling but the feeling is all And that brings me to the end of my kitchen clean and kitchen reset for the start of the year. I really hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I feel so happy now that my kitchen is in a much better place and that things are much more organised now and I just feel more ready to tackle the rest of the house so please do give us a thumbs up if you like this video because I can create more content like this if I know that you like it and thank you for watching.